Hello, beautiful people of the internet. My name is Ryan, and welcome back to our Skyrim blind playthrough here on YouTube. It's episode 239, and we're on to the Dawn Guard DLC, and specifically, we're on to the first little epi uh, little little quest of the uh, Dawn Guard DLC. We have to go to Dim Hollow Crypt. In the last episode, we struggled to do that. We accidentally ran up here, saw some bandits, killed some, found a pale lady. And also had this whole thing up here, which I'm very interested in. But that's not the purpose of this episode. This episode is going to be to do something different than that. Uh, so we're going to go to Dim Hollow Crypt. The problem I had last episode was that I couldn't figure out uh, exactly how to get there. It says that it's to the right, but also like it sort of appears like uh, to be uphill. So I have a thought. I have a thought. We have discovered Frostmere Crypt, technically. So that means we can fast travel here. Get our horse. Find Rhea. Hi, Rhea. Rhea, I'm going to ride you directly up the mountain and hope that this works. Uh, it's like vaguely that direction. So can you just go that way? Yeah? Oh my god, I just had a stroke. What was that? Oh my god. Lordy. I, I don't know. I'm so thankful that the horses have four-wheel drive in this game. Oh, don't look at it. Don't look at it. It hurts my brain to even think about. Because otherwise, we'd just be... I'd be screwed. I'd never find the correct path onto anything. <laughs> Rhea, I'd say you're better at this than your pred your predecessors so far. I... This is pretty good. I still can't believe that this is the method that, like, mostly works for me. Just kind of going back and forth, directly uphill. I think that's pretty close. There's a stone over here, by the way. I think I still need to go pretty far to the right, but... There is a stone. We'll give it a quick save so I don't have to climb that mountain anymore. Okay, I found it. I found it. Yes! Okay, so, now that we found it, let's, uh, let's re recenter ourselves on this quest. I, in the last episode, uh, met Isran, the leader of the group of vampire hunters of Dongard. Specifically, he was talking about the, ho the Hall of Vigilance and, uh, the people there who hate Daedra worshippers. Um, and, what's the name of the buddy who's gonna show up with me? There's vampires in here, and they were looking for something when they attacked the Hall of the Vigilance. One of the Hall of the Vigilance people... I think is going to be arriving here to help me. I think he's probably inside. So let's just go for it. Time to slay some, uh, slay some motherfucking, uh, vampires. We should use a cross, uh, crossbow. They get, they gave us a crossbow. We should use it. Let me, let me sort that out real quick. Uh, weapons, crossbow, incredible. Uh, let's just, let's, let's favorite it. Sure. F for favorite. Crossbow for... Uh, I'm not going to put it on one of the... These vigilants never know when to give up. I thought we'd taught them enough on of the hot bar. of their hall. To come in here alone. A fool like all the rest of them. He fought well, though. Oh, Get shit. And Bressoth were no match for him. Ha! Those two deserve what they got. He killed a couple. The arrogance had become insufferable. Oh, this talk is making me thirsty. He's dead for sure. Perhaps another vigilant will wander in soon. I wish Fuck. Would hurry it up. I have half a mind to return to the castle and tell Harkon what a fool one. he's entrusted this mission to. I wish Lokil would hurry up. Harkin? Lokil. Of your disloyalty. Lokil. You we already dead. heard. Now shut up and keep on watch. Are they below me? It sounded like it was, like, right here. I mean, there's that over there, for sure. There's a... Were do a, ver a vampire dog over there. I'm trying to sneak. I'm trying to be sneaky, boy. Sneaky little dragonborn. Oh, fuck. I really don't know how the crossbow works. Apparently. Oh, 
I'm so used to drawing it. I'm so used to drawing. Honestly, this is very cool, though. I'm gonna go third person for a second. And just, just start chunking them. Third person ch Oh, fuck. Almost fell down. Chunking them. Okay. Crossbow's pretty fucking cool. Turns out... It's just like a single shot gun, basically, but that's that's pretty fucking cool. I'm into it. It turns out I'm into it. We got 95 bullets for it. Bullets for it. Bolts for it. <laughs> Ammo for it. Um. Okay. What's the vampire armor? It counts as light armor. This is the Vigilant Tolan. Oh, this is our guy. Oh, no. This is... You were the person... Did I shoot you? Please don't have a steel... Okay. I sounded like he was dead when I walked up, but I was a little afraid that I had also shot him and maybe he was actually just being kept in some sort of limbo so that the vampires could suck his blood. But no, they killed him first. I mean, they, they killed him, period. So that's that's all right. Uh, all right, let's grab a steel bolt. I mean, I'm sorry that he died, but I, I didn't. I don't have to feel too sorry because I didn't do it, you know? I'm sorry, Tolan. I didn't mean to teabag your body like that. That was actually me bowing down. <laughs> I wasn't trying to teabag. I promise. All right, we've looted everybody. Uh, interesting. Okay, so somebody else was in there, it sounded like. They had one that was in there. What are they looking for? What are they looking for? That's what we have to figure out. Steel Sword of Colt. Okay, so it's just a frost enchantment, is that right? I'll carry it for now. Um, okay. Just loot up here, great. Ooh, but here's the thingy. Yes, beautiful. Okay, Jazargo, we figured it out. We figured it out, we figured out how to get in there, Jazargo. All right. That place is beautiful, by the way. I just want to say that. Because I didn't say it when I walked in. I thought it when I walked in, but I didn't say it because I was too busy listening to the vampires. It's going to take me a little bit to get used to this crossbow. No, like... No, no, like... Can I hold it? I can hold it, which is what I should do. But there's no, like, slow motion... Uh, uh, draw, uh, aiming motion like there is with the... Bow. Not a major difference, just a small one. But it is, it's worth it for style points, for sure. Nothing over there, it doesn't look like. And it seems to fucking do a lot of damage. I don't know... Over here. Where? Oh shit, Jazargo, you ran right in front of them! So got... Oh. And then, and this, and this way you can just like... Click it once. Just click it once. It does so much damage. It looks like it should do less than the... Uh... Let me see this. It says damage 78. Okay. Whereas the bow would say probably... I don't really remember. Where is my ebony bow? 104. So then it must be that you take the damage of the individual bolt and or arrow and... I wonder if they multiply or if they... I wonder how you determine what damage one individual shot does. I don't know. You alright there, buddy? Uh, I'll hit you with that just to be sure. Let's use a candlelight, too. It's ah, fucking dark. Like alright. Um, I don't know. I'm still puzzling that together, basically. Still puzzling that together. So is she still over here? I, th I thought maybe Jazargo killed her, but is she still, like, over here somewhere? Did she run? In oh, shit. Hello. I'm not very good at aiming it. I can tell you that much. Uh, crossbow. Vampire fledgling. fledgling. Man, I really hope I level up soon. I really want to get all of my alchemy. I want so badly to get this... Uh, this alchemy uh, level... It's going to require level 100 for sure. At least, and it's going to require like level 80 at least. 
to get that effect where you learn all of the uh, experiments are level three. Uh, did I loot all these bodies? I feel like there's a body over here I did not touch. Where did the actual vampire go? No? All right. I'm, di I'm too distracted. Too distracted. Let's go. Let's go. L-E-T-S-G-O. Draugr. <clears throat> I don't really need to be looting shit like that. This is exactly what I wanted, though. I wanted one of these so that I could test out what I have, and I'll just drop what I don't need because I don't need the money right now. All right, so Steel Sword of Cold, uh, I don't need. We're going to quickly empty uh, my inventory and also Jazargo's by doing this. Uh, I don't need you. Drop. I also don't know. I don't need that. Uh, all right, so, and then apparel. Uh, none of it matters. So, you. You are taking us somewhere. You, he says. You, Jazargo. I know, I know. Uh, and I actually want to take some stuff off of you this time. So if I took this. This. I think most of these we've actually checked already. This I've definitely checked. Staffs, you can't. Uh, you can't undo staffs anyways. Like you can't disenchant them. Lead on, My brain today, I swear. Uh, none of this stuff can be disenchanted, huh? Alright, cool. Unfortunately, Jazargo, I know that I could just give it to you, but instead what I'm going to do is I'm just going to dump it over here. <laughs> Forgive me, my friend. Forgive me. It's easier for me to manage my inventory, uh, especially the way we're playing where I, like, sort of drop in and out of recording every couple days. The pro is I get to be constantly playing. I probably should give you this one. Uh, the the con is I definitely just forget some stuff between Cashy's recording sessions. Alright. So I'm going to give you one thing and then I'm going to get out of here. And we'll continue going. I just want you to have this because I feel like it it fits you. Um, not that you have to wear it, but I feel like you should have it. Uh, Alright, sweet. Let's, let's, let's do it. Who are you shooting? Wait, who are you fighting? Oh, did I just shoot Jazargo in the back? I think I might have. I don't think they can see us yet. We're really not doing a lot of damage. Oh, you're fighting the Death Lord. Okay, cool. This is really not doing any. I'm gonna I'm gonna enchant this crossbow ASAP. Y'all are doing great. At this point, I'm basically just picking sides here. This is fun. So now I should pick the uh, the side of the vampire. I'm just I'm just full clicking. Oh! Are you fleeing? You're not allowed to flee. You don't get to run. I shot you right in the butt. You don't get to run. Okay, I'm going to be a cross moment now. It's going to be so annoying. You guys are going to hear that sound, that little thoosh, all of the time. All you're going to hear is me doing this. It's honestly a lot of fun. I like the staggering effect. I'm going to need a lot more steel bolts, Isran. All right, I'm a full convert to the crossbow family. It turns out this guy has at least 80 steel bolts inside of him. I know it says nine, but... That's just a, a bug. It's actually 80. Uh, incredible. I, I've completely changed my mind. Crossbow is going on the hot bar. Let's put it on like seven. Uh, it's incredible. Incredible. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to ask her, uh, what she, uh, was here for though. Wonder if there's more. There's something right here. Oh, this is creepy looking. Oh, I don't like this. Am I going to get locked in here? I should quick save. The fuck? Is this thing booby trapped? No. It's just. It's just loot. Okay. All right. Beautiful.
Okay. Um, nothing worth it. Damn. I feel like I got to keep rolling the dice on looting stuff like that, though. One, because uh, my lock picking deserves to be 100. I need it to be 100. And two, because... <clears throat> I... There's just a couple enchantments left. And I want them. I think I think there's only a couple enchantments left. I don't actually know that. But uh, it's felt like a long goddamn time since I've gotten a new enchantment. And I want a new one. Alright, we quick save off in... Is there going to be a vampy out here? Oh, there's a vampy right up there. Are they going to talk to me or are they going to fight though? Oh, hello. I'm hidden. You can't see me. That's pretty fucking cool. All right, sweet. I'm a... like I needed converting. Let's go to some dwarven ruins so I can get some dwarven bolts and uh You going to fight me or you want to talk? You're telling me that didn't kill the skeleton? Now it's dead. Ah, oh, so you just want to talk. All right, cool. All right, come here. Listen, I'm not very... You got to get close so I can hit you with this thing. <laughs> oh, no. This is really not that effective. I have to, like, uh... I have to, uh... Hey, right, come here. I have to enchant that thing or something. It's really not that good. Against anyone who is aware that I'm attacking at all, it's really not that good. Uh, currently. Oh, shit. Your item has insufficient charge. Well, I can take care of that here in a second. Oi, come here. Beautiful. Beautiful. Incredible. Uh, okay. Well, well done, Jazago. I'm really getting to the point where I don't want to think about losing you someday, Jazago. Please stay with me forever. At this point, I honestly think you and I make the best team. Like, I, I don't know. I just feel... I'm just going to miss you when you're gone. So you're not allowed to leave. Uh, all right. We should charge some other stuff while we're here. Like Dawnbreaker, which we're not even really using right now. Um, the Ebony Bow, we should probably charge just a little bit. All right. Hmm. I probably should have enchanted at that enchanting table back there. Shit. Maybe I can get it on the way out. We'll see. I should have thought about that. Are you alive? Something out there. Oh, no, you were not. Okay. I wish you could ADS with this gun. Or with this, uh... <laughs> Two times damage is great, though. Also, fuck these dogs. I didn't shoot you, did I, Chisargo? I hope that one didn't hit you either. Alright. Onward! Onward! Ancient vampire, come here, you- t Oh, Jesus! Fuck, that's a spider! Ah! There's a lot happening here! Oh my god! Okay, you're all dead. Can I heal you? Alright. Oh, Jesus. You are a... You're a lot. You're a lot to handle. My health is fine, though. Alright, I should block. Oh! There's a lot happening when you're fighting with Jazargo. It's actually insane. There's a lot happening sometimes. Lightning everywhere. It's crazy. Well done, friend. Well done. Um, all right, we quick save and we're on. I didn't like, did not like the spiders I saw in here. Between that and the hounds, oh man, it gave me a bad vibe. 
Very bad vibe. I don't like you. I don't like you. There's a door over there. Chest right here. Ugh. Yikes. <clears throat> Alright. Let's see here. Oh, there's a big fucking spider in there. Oh, that's where we were earlier. Nightmaster Vampire. I mean, we should go in there, right? Why are you both at what? Run. I'm stuck. I'm I'm stuck. I'm fully stuck. I don't like you at all. I don't like you at all. Okay. You're very not strong though. I thought maybe y'all I could just I wanted to third party. I wanted to what's known as third party. From a distance, you and I, Jazargo. From a distance. Just don't wander in front of my crossbow. It's time. You're nothing, he says. Night What's up with you, Nightmaster? Also, I wonder what Nightmaster means. I wonder if that's like a higher, the highest level. Or a high level. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Whew. I, I beheaded him. Jesus. Vampire armor of imminent conjuration? That seems really good. Jazargo, do you want to put this on? I know you're not a vampire, but... Do you want to put this on? I'll give it to you later. I'll give it to you later. Uh, <clears throat> Shit, wrong button. I think you'd look pretty good in it. And also, I think your lightning is destruction magic. That seems obvious, but I think it is. This is really beautiful. And also very creepy. I don't like y'all. Oh. Y'all are vampire gargoyles, and I don't like it. Oh, man. Oh, it gives me heebie-jeebies, this place. Okay, all right, we go forward. Mm. What's in Dim Hollow Cavern? I'll never tell you anything, vampire. My oath to Stendar is stronger than any suffering you can inflict on me. I believe you, Vigilant. And I don't think you even know what you found here. So go and meet your beloved Stendar. Are you sure that was wise, Lokio? He still might have told us. Oh, he killed him. We haven't gotten anywhere and ourselves with moves, nothing. He served his purpose by leading us to this place. Now it is up to us to bring Harkov the prize, and we will not return without it. Vingalmo and Vortex this is so beautiful. For me after this. Yes, of course, Lokio. Do not forget who brought okay. you news of the. Okay. So we have a political struggle among the vampires. I never forget who my friends are. They went for the Vigilance because this whole place exists. They don't know that we're here yet. Uh, we're going to have to get closer. Um, we're going to take both of these. What do you think this button does? Oh, shit. That ain't it. Okay. Well... This place looks like something uh, from the from the Lord of the Rings in the be in movies in the best possible way. Um, like it just looks like an an enormous, awesome architectural structure, dramatic lighting from the heaven. You know, but tell me that doesn't look like a scene from like Twin to uh, t <laughs> Twin Towers. <laughs> Two towers. <laughs> I'm also reading Lord of the Rings right now, so rereading. So I'm sure that's the reason that I'm thinking of it, but. All right, I see at least two there. This looks like a puzzle. I can't tell if anyone's closer as well. What's the book? Notes on Dim Hollow Crypt Volume 3? As written by Adelwald. Are you, this is the person who just died, right? Okay. 
uh, Divines be praised here at last. Also, there was a lot of conversation about Stindar. Mm, I don't know. Okay, uh, I'm, I'm piecing together a history or an idea of what the Vigilance, the Hall of Vigilance people might be. And also why the vampires might be. I don't know. Divines be praised. Here at last is the breakthrough I've been seeking. All the dangers I've escaped. The traps I have eluded and the foul dragger I have avoided have brought me at last to this. In my previous volume of notes and observations regarding Dimhala's crypt possible connections to the ancient vampire clans of Skyrim's history, I wrote of a great chamber far larger than anything else I've yet seen here in the crypt. Alas, a few wandering dragger forced me to retreat to the earlier passages of the crypt, depriving me of an opportunity to study this huge cavern. Praise be to Stindar. As I write this, I've just spent nearly a full day exploring that very cavern. It was a risk that proved more than worth it. Central to this huge cavern <clears throat> is an island of stone in a subterranean lake. Upon this island is something I can only describe as an elaborate ceremonial construction surrounded by stone columns linked by arches. There's no mistaking the stark contrast in architecture here. No ancient Nords made this stonework. Here, too, were more of the gargoyle statues that I first glimpsed in earlier passageways. There is no Draugr burial site in Skyrim that contains these statues, save Dim Hollow Crypt. Indeed, I am now certain. <clears throat> the strange construct in this main, cha main chamber was built long after the crypt. Long after the crypt. Ah, I see. So you have an ancient Nord temp uh, uh, crypt, and then someone comes in, and digs out a farther cavern right where we saw those first gargoyles so it's it's after that this part has been built these must be the same builders who placed the gargoyles through the crypt perhaps to frighten away the curious all signs seem to indicate that the masons who crafted these strange arches were servants of some ancient master who favored necromancy or vampirism style and craftsmanship in the stonework are not only distinct in terms of design seeming to speak of an entirely different culture than that of the old lord peoples but also in skill the cutting and shaping of the stone suggests more sophisticated tools than the crypt's original architects would have possessed, although I feel a sense of exhilaration that my theories have at last been confirmed. I'm also disappointed at the lack of answers. How long ago were these new features added to the crypt, and by whom, and for what purpose? On one point, I have no doubts. I must return to the Hall of Vigilant and share these uh, findings with my brothers and sisters. When they see what I've discovered with my own eyes, they will no longer scoff at my theories or mock my endeavors and when that is done i will return to my work for now dim hollow crypt might be a mystery but by stindar i will see that mystery solved incredible incredible vigilant i'm uh the person <laughs> vigilant his name everybody's got these amulets of stindar i'm gonna go ahead and give a full save i don't know that i've full saved in a while uh, okay. Exciting! Oh, buddy, I love a mystery. One. They're gonna see me in two seconds. I had to. I had to. I leveled up. Let's go! I don't think they know that I'm here still because I attacked him at exactly the right time. So here's two more. Are there? My question is, is there, are there people on the other thing? Like on the other side. He did. Oh, there's something on that central pedestal. Okay. Let's see if we can get one more in a sneak attack. They won't know it's coming. Let's do this one. That's low kill. He still didn't know where I was. Alright. Oh my god. Fuck you. I need to hit you, 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 because I need your health. I need your health. Beautiful. Easy. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Ah, you almost killed me. Holy shit. Uh, I should have taken a potion. Break your concentration. Break your concentration. She's really hurting me, actually. Am I out of charge again? That's what it is. Oh, man. This Nightingale Blade is great, but man, it runs out of charge all the time. Oh, 
Uh, beautiful work to Zargo. Holy shit. This was a really cool fight. Truly cool fight. Uh, I feel like I just woke from a nap. Uh, I feel like I just woke from a nap, by the way. Look at that. Oh, man. Oh, this is cool. There is a rampway over there. So there's definitely some loot over there. There's got to be. Oh, man, it's huge. I'm going to spend more time here. I got to figure out what's in the center, though. I can push these. Okay. It's a button. Okay. Interesting. We have a puzzle. I thought I saw that gargoyle and I almost shit my pants because I thought it was another vampire. And I was like, what is that vampire doing just sitting there? Weirdo. Why? Okay. This is incredible. There's a whole nother archway over here. Oh, this is very cool. More loot around the edges. I don't need to loot necessarily. Uh, we really don't need the money. I need the inventory space more than I need other things. But God damn it, it's fun. What are these? Why are there eyes? Uh, all right, we're gonna run around just a little bit here. We have to we have to We'll figure out this puzzle, but you know me Just a little bit of running around See what good old Bethesda divs devs did in the corners here. Are you really oh man? I don't want to go in the water All right, the water is very shallow. Thank God is that a fish? There's a fish in here. Of Nope, uh, nope, I'm trying to catch a fish. Vampire fish? What? It'd be under V. Is it food? Oh my god. You are terrifying. If I drop you, does that mean that I release you and you start swimming again? No? Okay. A dire fish. Oh my lord. Oh, okay. I don't know. I don't know that I need that one either. Uh, cool. So we're going to go up on the other side now. Over here. And just see what's going on. We follow that. I think I'm going to go ahead and put a... Uh, this is not important at all. But I'm going to go ahead and put Dawnbreaker. Dawnbreaker con continues to be my favorite uh, my favorite sword. I'm going to put it back on the favorite that I use the most, which is four. There's got to be something over here. Because there's no way they would give us this walkway down. Oh, they do it so you can get into the water. I understand. Okay, cool. I was like, there's no way they'd give you this walkway down and not give you something to do. But they do it so you can get into the water. All right, cool. Sweet. So let's go figure out this puzzle. And then we got something on the other end to do too. Up there. Let's try and push the button as is. Oh. <gasps> oh. 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 I don't like that. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. Hmm. What happened? Why? What happened? Oh, there's a line this way. Okay. Does it need to all be lined up right here? Is that what we're doing here? Shit, I went the wrong way. Nope, now it's on flames though. Uh-oh. Uh, I meant to push it. All right, cool, that works too. Nope, you just go up and down, okay. The 
They're catching flame when they're close. Not all of them, though. That one did. I, uh... As discussed previously, I'm not a fan of blades and cutting. And, uh, that one... Uh, hit me hard. That, oh man. Just completely out of nowhere. Alright, cool. So, we just have to go individual. We figured it out. Beautiful. Oh, I don't like that. I'm not pushing the fucking button again. Activate stone monolith? Okay. What? Does she have an elder scroll? Where is... Who sent you here? Who are you expecting? I was expecting someone... Like me, at least. What do you mean? Uh, can't you tell just from looking at me? A vampire. Why were you locked away like this? That's complicated. And I'm not totally sure if oh, I can trust no. you. But if you want to know the whole story, help me get back to my family's home. Where do you need to go? My family used to live on an island to the west of Solitude. I would guess they still do. By the way, my name is Serana. Good to meet you. On the island west of Solitude. Is it the- wait, hold up. Is it the ice? Hold up. I have a lot of thoughts right now. What? You have an Elder Scroll on your goddamn back. I'm about to ask you about that. You're a vampire whom the game is making me feel empathetic towards. Which I honestly did not expect. And I'm I'm doubting that lack of expectation now. Like, I obviously should have expected that. Because that's the most interesting way to go with this. Also, I just met Isran and I liked him. And now I'm going to have to betray him. What in the fuck is happening here? There's so many questions. Is that an elder? Uh, what should we ask first? You're a follower. <gasps> Is that an Elder Scroll on your back? Oh shit, sorry. Is that an Elder Scroll on your back? Yes, it is. And it's mine. Why do you have an Elder Scroll? It's complicated. You have to tell me. About it. I'm sorry. playing a game called Elder Scrolls. You have to tell me. How long were you in there? Oh my god. Why were you locked away? I'd rather not get into that with you. No, you have if to tell me. Right. I'm sorry, it's not that... It's just that I don't know who I can trust yet. Let's get to my home, and I'll have a better sense of where we all stand. Of course I'm going with you, but I got... Tell me about your home. It's on an island near Solitude. Hopefully we can find Is a it place icy? to take us there. Is it icy? It's my family home. Not the most welcoming place, but... I'm going to look at my quest marker here in a second, but is it icy? I got to know. Why wouldn't you be safe there? Let's just say that my mother and father had a bit of a falling out. Don't worry, I'm not in any danger or anything like that. It'll just be more unpleasant to run into my father. Listen, I know... ...that Jazargo in that helmet is the most attractive thing that has ever happened to Skyrim. But Serana in this choker-type cape might be the second most thing. Third most thing, sorry. Lydia obviously is first. Obviously, Lydia in whatever she happens to be wearing or not wearing that day is obviously first. Jazargo is a, a close second. Serana is a close, and this cape thing is a close third behind that. All right, uh, how long were you in there? Your mother and father. Hold up, I'm gonna go one more dialogue option down. It's on an island. It's my family. Uh, my someone you don't want to see. My father and yeah, I okay. don't really get along. Ugh, saying what the it out fuck loud is happening? Little girl who doesn't get along with her father 
I've daddy asked issues. Away a hundred times. I have. You're right. She's smart too. Oh, she's self-aware. You are very empathetic right now. Damn it. Any idea how to get out? Uh, how long were you in here? Good question. Hard <laughs> to say. I, I can't really tell. I feel yeah. like it was a long time. Oh no. Who is Skyrim's High King? It's actually a matter for debate. <laughs> oh, wonderful. A war of succession. Good to know the world didn't get boring while I was gone. Who are the contenders? The Empire supports Elisif. There are many in Skyrim loyal. Skyrim loyal to Ulfric. Empire? What? Oh shit. What empire? This the empire from Cyrodiil? Cyrodiil is the seat of an empire? I must have been gone longer than I thought. Definitely longer than we planned. You planned Please, with who? Let's hurry. I need to get home so I can figure out what's happening. What in the fuck is happening here? Any idea how to get out of here? Your guess is as good as mine. This place looks <clears throat> pretty different from when I was locked away. I am so sorry, Jazargo, but it is time for you to leave. Wait, is it a, is it a, it's a DLC one. I can keep... I can keep Jizargo, I think. Why don't you keep your I hope. Things and I'll it's like Freya? Them. Maybe? I can't trade things with you? Oh. If anyone sneaks up on us, I'll smell them coming. Or I might not. We will see. I'm just just hold hold still. I'm trying to look at your I'm trying to look at your fucking Elder Scroll, god damn it. I've seen exactly one Elder Scroll before, Serana. I'm sorry. You can't get mad at me for staring. All right, let's go. Um, I think we got to go up there, right? We must have to. Oh, what? You got to be kidding me. Are you are you flesh? You are flesh. Oh my God, y'all are terrifying. Kill it before I look at it too close. They're not that strong though. Interesting. They do not appear to be that strong. They have jewels inside of them and ores inside of them. Oh, you're an ugly motherfucker. Oh, I just harvested Bleeding Crown on accident. You are an ugly one. Okay. Now you I will teabag freely. Um, interesting. What? <laughs> There's a skelly boy right here. Come here, boy. I whiffed. <laughs> Sorry. Did it just say search skeleton? While he was still alive? Was that a friendly skeleton? Hold up. Stay right there. I'm just trying to look at this. Does the air feel God damn it. heavy down here? I'm a little woozy, but it might just be from waking up. I don't know about heavy. I don't know. Can't really tell. The game hasn't told me that it feels heavy, so I don't know that it feels heavy. If I go over by the, right way. I was starting to worry. if I go over there, I wonder if those gargoyles will wake up. I'm not gonna check it. This is incredible. The amount of twists and turns in this episode already. Oh man. So far, 12 out of 10 DLC. Uh, I should save. I haven't. I haven't saved in ages. And we're gonna quickly get to the end of the episode. Oh no. We're going to have a fight here. Uh, okay. Okay. Um, it's really dark here. It's really dark here. I'm going to have to wander into these. Oh my God. It is dark here. Wander into these corners. See what's going on. I think we're going to call it an episode here. Uh, I think the wisest call is for me to do that. Uh, before we, before we press forward, that looked kind of like a door. Ooh, we do have a lever. All right. We're going to, we're going to stop here. Holy shit. Serana is in the party. Gargoyles are real. Oh, I haven't, I haven't looked yet. I haven't looked yet. Lead Serana to her home. Does it, uh, does it, is it? It's not Icewater Jetty. It's just an island. 
Oh, wait. It do I don't know yet. It might still be to the island out here because it doesn't say. Okay, beautiful. Oh, I can't wait to find out. Oh, my God. Thanks so much for watching this episode. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I cannot wait for the next one already. Luckily, I haven't missed the sunlight, but I do miss fresh air. Luckily, I get to uh, keep recording here in a second. And y'all will have to wait until tomorrow. I'm very sorry. But we'll see you tomorrow at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here on the YouTube channel for more. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.